face around his back. Now that's something. Kind of disappoints me they couldn't get any new voice actors for the DLC. How dare you trespass here? Wait, Serana? Is that truly you? I cannot believe my eyes. My lord, everyone! Serana has returned! I guess I'm expected. I can't believe it! My long-lost daughter returns at last. I trust you have my Elder Scroll. After all these years, that's the first thing you ask me? Yes, I have the scroll. Of course she has I'm the scroll. delighted to see you, my daughter. Must I really say the words aloud? Ah, if only your traitor mother were here. I would let her watch this reunion before putting her head on a spike. Now tell me, who is this stranger you have brought into our hall? This is my savior, the one who freed me. For my daughter's safe return, you have my gratitude. Tell me, what is your name? I am SOC Hobbit. Who are you? I am Harkon, Lord of this court. By now, my daughter will have told you what we are. Uh, <laughs> you're a reclusive cannibal cult. You're vampires. Not just vampires. We are among the oldest and most powerful vampires in Skyrim. For centuries we lived here far from the cares of the world. All that ended when my wife betrayed me and stole away that which I valued most. Uh, what happens now? You have done me a great service, and now you must be rewarded. There is but one gift I can give that is equal in value to the Elder Scroll and my daughter. I offer you my blood. Take it and you will walk as a lion among sheep. Men will tremble at your approach, and you will never fear death again. And if I refuse your gift? Then you will be prey, like all mortals. I will spare your life this once, but you will be banished from this hall. Perhaps you still need convincing. Behold the power! This is the power that I offer now. Make your choice. I will accept your gift and become a vampire. Be still. Wow. Vampires can bite through Daedric armor. What happened? Why are you fuzzy, man? Awake at last. Good. Everything's still so fuzzy. growing within you, and now you must learn to wield it. What happened? How, how did I get here? My blood is potent. At first the body is overwhelmed by it. After my bite, you collapsed and fell into a slumber. Now your flesh has acclimated to the new blood that courses through your veins. I assure you, no harm was done. In truth, your strength surprises me. Not all mortals can withstand my embrace. But I am no true mortal. I am Dovahkiin. With my guidance, you will become a deadly instrument, striking terror into the hearts of mortals wherever you tread. Now listen to my words and do as I instruct. The true power of the ancient blood is found in the form of the Vampire Lord. Assume the mantle of the Vampire Lord, and we will continue. Use your Vampire Lord power. All right, go to powers. Vamp vampire Lord. Favorite. Transform Booyah. In 
this well, form. Um, okay. You can drain the life from your bones with your right hand. With your left hand, you can wield the power of blood magic to raise the dead. You can also call upon the powers of night to turn into a swarm of bats. They appear some distance away. Should you run out of magicka, you can descend to the ground. And fight as the beasts do. Do so now, and we will continue. Good. You are weaker while you You cannot access the blood magic. However, the night powers are still your to command, and your claws are still. Over time, your powers will grow in strength, and you will find new ways to use your gifts. Tab. Ooh, I like that. Health, yes, like that. Uh, I like that. Mm, yeah, that's all right. And the other perk. Okay, everything slows down while you move. No, stop it. Uh, that's all right. Ooh, I like that. I like that. And I definitely like that. Definitely going right. There is much to learn. But if you master the powers of the Vampire Lord, few enemies will be able to stand against you. Right, I see that. Ooh, night vision. There is one last thing you must know. Slaying mortal enemies with your life drain grants you new night powers. I keep a stable of thralls in the castle, should you need to feed like the baser vampires to stave off the sun. That is all I have to teach you. If you wish to be reminded of these lessons, you need only ask. I have a task that will test your new powers. At first, do you have any questions? Hold on, no one. thing is to his subjects. So you are to There we go, back to my old Daedric armor. I sense the power of the ancient blood. What must I know about being a vampire? Me. As a vampire, you will gain new powers, but also a weakness to sunlight. With each passing day that you do not feed, that weakness will become more deadly, but your powers will also become stronger. Feed upon those who are sleeping, and your vulnerability to sunlight will diminish along with your powers. Tell me again. No, I don't want to tell me again. I'm ready to carry out this task. Good. Go and speak to Garen Marethi. Tell him it is time. He will understand. Okay, so it takes a little bit to revert form. I need to go this way. From what I've heard, 
people have told me, or I've heard in podcasts, that uh, you don't want to... Wait, conversation? Maybe? Don't get in my way, and I won't tear your arms off. Simple, isn't it? Perhaps. Another elf, I see. I'm sure Velgalmo is sizing you up as we speak, trying to figure if you're friend or foe. He'll tell you what a monster I am, that I can't be trusted. You mark my words, it's him you need to worry about. If it'll get him closer to being in charge, he'll slit your throat without a moment's thought. You don't trust Vinglomo? No, and if you're smart, you won't either. I know he's one of your kind and all, but he's only looking out for himself. You think you're best of friends until you find his fangs in your neck. All right. All right then. Life here is better than you could find anywhere. He's yeah, let's uh see my. Okay, that's just creepy. I'm putting my helmet back on. You'll be a welcome. If I may, let me offer you a piece of advice. Be careful who you trust. Not all of us have the court's best interests at heart. Orthiolf, for example. He'll tell you he means well, but believe me, he can't be trusted at all. Keep that in mind, will you? Why can't Orthiolf be trusted? He claims to serve loyally, but he really covets the throne. He sees himself in charge someday. His ambition will justify any actions. Put your faith in him, and you will regret it, I promise you. Right, so basically mm -hmm. those two are both putting me against the other. Hello there. Do you need something? Sit down and enjoy yourself. <sighs> What the? What the? The feast never ends here in Castle. Don't even think oh my gosh, that, 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 that scared me. I leave politics to up. Leave me in peace. Okay, she doesn't want to talk. Um, I hear blacksmith. And fighting. New blood, eh? Let's get something very clear. I don't care about politics. You want to fight over the throne with the rest of them, go right ahead. That sounds like I a new voice. I feed when I'm hungry, I sleep when I'm tired, and I kill whenever I'm in the mood. Those are the things that are important to me. Uh, how do you serve Lord Harkin? Simple. He says kill. I kill. <laughs> Sometimes. He doesn't even have to say it. Right. Enjoy your hunt. You, do you have any steel? Can you feel it? You're now so much more than you were before. Time was I could barely hold my own in the Companions. Now I could slaughter them all without a second thought. And I'm not half the vampire Lord Harkon is. Truth is, I'm better with a forge than I am with claws or fangs. Uh, what do you got for I sale? I keep the forge running day and night in case Lord Harkon needs anything. Um, do you have any steel bolts? No. Vampire armor. Different colors, that's interesting, but cool. Uh, steel, steel, steel. Give me your steel. And some... I don't know what I need. Yeah, that's... Good day. Forge steel. Oh, uh, the Chase's swords. Get down a normal steel. Steel, steel arrows. Wait, what? Misc, maybe? I have no idea what that is. Um. No, where? Um. Where do I make bolts? Can I make bolts? I thought I could make bolts. Uh, do I, am I up to dragon armor on this character? I should be because I'm Daedric. Maybe not. So I can't make bolts. That sucks. I want to make bolts for my crossbow. Uh, maybe I, maybe that comes later. Never made it far in the companions. Wait, now, you're a companion? If you need anything? I, I was. 
didn't progress very far. Never did care for their attitude, acting like they're better than everyone else. But none of that matters now. Right. Feast on so life basically again. you're saying you don't like the companions. I get it. Bolts? Crap. <clears throat> um, okay. Uh, where's that pretty lady, Serana? Wait, what's over here? Dead people. Who are you? I hope you find life in the castle to be to your liking. Is training in speech? Heck yeah. It's my duty to serve and I'm happy to do it. Uh, what do you do here? Of course. No, it is go my away. duty to serve and I'm happy to do it. I've scrounged up a few things. No. Here, Blarg. Please, take a look. No. I don't uh, do you have bolts? Come on, give me bolts. I want bolts. Life here has many advantages. You're scary looking. It's always a pleasure to serve a fellow alchemist. No, alchemy. Yeah. Revel in your power. I saw more than enough political maneuvering in my time in house dress. I was tired You're of it. You're very then. scary. I'm tired of it. Lord Harkon, remember your place. Now, what is our Lord's wish? Uh, he said it is time. Well, well. He wants the chalice then. You've heard of the Bloodstone Chalice? Um, never heard of it. It is a rather well-kept secret. The chalice has been in Lord Harkon's possession for quite some time now. It is, when used properly, able to increase the potency of our powers. He has neglected using it for ages. If he wants it filled now, then grander things are afoot. This is good. Follow me. I'll take you to it. Lord Harkon has never cared to use the chalice. Relying on his more than adequate powers until now. This is an intriguing. You're a creepy chance. puppy. Oh, there's the pretty lady. Which is a little awkward considering I'm a female character. Yes. Excuse us. I need to fetch the bloodstone chalice. The chalice? Why? What are you up to, Garan? Lord Harkin's orders, Ortheolf. Calm yourself. Our friend here has been ordered to fill the chalice. Really? Indeed. She's off to Redwater Den. Well then, best of luck to you. Then Galmo and Ortheolf are Harkin's primary advisors. I'm sure they're quite surprised to learn that you're taking the chalice. Hello. Well met, sister. Sit down and enjoy yourself. Now, this chalice needs to be filled directly from the blood spring that is the source of Red Water Dead. But that's not enough. Once that's done, the blood of a powerful vampire needs to be added to it. Keep in mind that Red Water Den has fallen into... Well, let's just say less reputable members of society now dwell there. It's your choice whether...